We have a brand new line of coats for men who think they're women. Meet the Snow Tucket, a nice warm winter jacket with a bathing suit sewn right in so you can tuck your woman dick right up in there and stay warm on that trail girl. North Face has gotten in the game and decided to Bud Light themselves. Welcome back to the JP Rex channel, my beautiful freedom-loving friend, where we like to call out the lies, hypocrisy, and corruption of tyrants, shine the light of awareness on woke absurdities, and highlight the amazing work of other freedom fighters. Today, we've got woke absurdities uh, by way of North Face and freedom fighting by way of amazing comedian and a friend of mine, Tyler Fisher. With Pride Month upon us, we're gonna be seeing a lot more companies say, hey, we just saw what happened to Bud Light, then what happened to Target. We too would like to get in the game of losing all our customers and getting boycotted for promoting dangerous ideologies to people and children. So North Face says, it's our turn, let's do it. So they just published an ad with a drag queen for Pride Month. Now, let's take a look at that before we take a look at Tyler Fisher's very comedic rebuttal to it. Hi, it's me, Patagonia, a real life homosexual. This is the real ad. You might think that's like meant to be some kind of parody, but real ad. And today I'm here with the North Face. We are here to invite you to come out in nature with us. Wow, this is nice. If you didn't think Dylan Mulvaney made a mockery of women enough, then this guy says, Dylan, hold my beer and it's a Bud Light. We like to call this little tour the Summer of Pride. This tour has everything. Oh. Hiking, community, art, lesbians, lesbians making art. Le that lesbians making art is one of the most profound aspects of nature you'll find in the woods while you're wearing your Patagonia jacket. Last year, we gay saw shade across the nation and celebrated pride across the nation with hundreds of you across the nation. This year, we're back. All right, I have seen enough of that. So <laughs> let's go over here to Tyler Fisher's Instagram page if you're not following him. He is a great follow. He, uh, you find him on Instagram, YouTube, all the places. He's a great comedian and he does his fair amount of calling out the woke BS through his brilliant style of comedy. What's up bitches? Welcome to the new brand. It is no longer North Face, it is now Woman Face. <laughs> we have a brand new line of coats for men who think they're women. Meet the Snow Tucket, a nice warm winter jacket with a bathing suit sewn right in so you can tuck your woman dick right up in there and stay warm on that trail girl woman dick and if you get thirsty up on those mountains this jacket comes with a refreshing bud light <laughs> oh only available at target more like target oh. <laughs> so this june come out drop your kids off and let us take them up the trail for a little broke back mountain <laughs> woman face we take pride in isolating 99 percent <laughs> of the country it's pretty gay right Okay, right? Okay, Nobel Peace Prize to Tyler Fisher. I think it's brilliant. And I think him making a mockery of North Face, who's making a mockery of women, is extremely well placed. The first serious ad you saw, it's it's like that. that is a complete mockery. Women don't act like that. I know a lot of gay men and they don't even act like that. It is such, in my opinion, a disrespectful mockery. And I am grateful that North Face has the freedom to do that if they want. I'm grateful Tyler Fisher has the freedom to make a mockery of those who are making a mockery of women. I think that's great. And I'm grateful that you and I, we have the freedom to vote with our dollars, our attention, where we spend our money, and in this case, where we don't spend our money. Bud Light, I just read their, uh, their company has now lost over $15 billion in value. Target, I just read that they have lost $10 billion in value. I haven't seen any numbers on North Face yet, but I'm guessing the freedom lovers, uh, truth seekers, those who respect faith over fictional 1984 narratives, they're gonna be voting with their dollars and placing them in other places than North Face. So North Face, congratulations. You just got yourself in line for a beautiful boycott. 
you earned it. Now I want to tell you about a product a company that actually does their customers good, Organifi. I have something I want to tell you. My health and fitness is very important to me. It's something I take very seriously. In part because I'm a narcissist, but also I simply love to feel and function at my best so I can be productive and have a good quality of life. And that's exactly why I love Organifi because it helps support my health and fitness goals. Organifi is a line of organic superfood blends that offers your body superb nutrition and high quality ingredients. We all know that you are what you eat. And when it comes to working out, you have to rebuild your muscles with high quality ingredients. But unfortunately, it's not as simple as just getting your macros of proteins, fats, and carbs. You also need high quality micronutrients if you wanna keep progressing towards your goals and recovering from your workouts. And that's exactly what Organifi is perfect for. The first part of my morning routine every day is the Organifi Green Juice Blend. It's convenient, it's delicious, and it costs less than $3 a day. If you wanna treat yourself to the best organic superfoods on the planet, then go to Organifi.com JP. And while you're there, use the code JP for 20% off. Enjoy.